Hello, my name is Eddie Tofpik. I'm Head of Technical Analysis and Senior Markets Analyst at ADM Investor Services International Limited. Here is your daily technical analysis of LME, 3 month copper and aluminium. I'll start with LME, 3 month copper. An immediate countering day two in a two-day meeting lines pattern yesterday. Now, traditionally, this pattern would be seen as a two-day bearish meeting lines pattern bearish meeting lines pattern. However, data indicates that this type of pattern is likely to be a mildly bullish pattern, or just over half the time it is. The following sessions end up being bullish. Thus, it will be interesting to see if we end up following tradition or the data. Overall, the market is still clinging to the fairly shallow middle time, currently 10.303 of the September 2021 to middle of December 2022 bullish shift pitchfork. It seems the market has been happy now for quite a while to use this middle time as an attractor and also as a rolling higher support of sorts. So far today, well, right now it looks like the market seems to be following tradition rather than the data by heading lower towards the support of the February 2011 high at 10,190. LME 3 month aluminium. An immediate countering key reversal down and bearish double yesterday after the previous session's bullish engulfing pattern, if only just. The market is still in the process of forming a possible descending triangle, started back in early March, and we're in the throes of the last few days of making such a pattern, so watch out for false breaks. Support below is mainly based on the flat base of the descending triangle at the high from October 2018 at 3229 with additional bands of support at 3260 and 3279. We also have or resistance I suppose really now. We also have the high from early February at 3333 and the previous all-time high from July 2008 at 3380 added into the mix. Also floating around is a slowly rising short medium moving average currently 33.77 and of course the upper trend line of the possible descending triangle pattern which is a, currently a 33.15. We've not popped the descending triangle caucus yet but I can still see give an idea of the size of move that might be expected. An initial move higher would be in the order of about $506 on top of the confirmed break level whilst an initial move low would be about $489 off from the confirmed break level. Watch and wait, it will not be much longer now, however tortuous the market attempts to make it. Now, so far today, a slightly higher open followed by a tentative attempt lower, testing the support at 32.29. Underneath this, we really do not have that much support until the rising medium moving average currently at 31.30. And given the size of the overhang overhead, I have my doubts about this holding prices. Meanwhile above, beyond the trend line of the descending triangle, we have the cap of the slowly rising short medium moving average currently at 33.77. Thank you for listening. This short version of broadcast gives essential market patterns and consequences. Please be aware of the risk disclaimer posted with this broadcast. Copyright is Eddie Topic and ADM Investor Services International Limited. And here comes the final bit.